How's it going everyone? I wanted to bring this video today to kind of do a recap of the one that I posted last week called A Little About Me. Um, that was definitely, definitely a big moment for me. Um, that video alone has been something or a content like it that I've been trying to share for years. Um, probably five or six years to be exact. Uh, the reason why I wanted to bring this video to you is kind of give you a little bit more background of where that stems from, you know, as far as me and my experience, you know, for the past you know, few years as a young man. When I was 19 years old, I started to see things differently. I don't really know exactly what it was or what pinpointed it, but life seemed to change. You know, I used to, I started to appreciate things a lot more. Things meant a lot more to me. I started to feel a certain connection, not only with people and relationships, but this world as a whole. I began to see beauty in so many things, you know, from the conversations that I was having with people to literally just walking outside in the morning and seeing, you know, the wind blow through the trees to the songs that I was hearing, to the commercials I was watching. I don't know, it just seems like I was be able to pull all the good and all the love that was coming from every single moment that I was experiencing. And it was, it was very foreign to me. I didn't know what it was. I don't know what I was going through or what it was about, but I, I felt like nobody saw what I was seeing um, at that point in time. I was very, even in my life, I was very distant because I didn't know what I was experiencing. I didn't know what this was. I was even very um, hesitant to even share that with my parents. So much so that we even got in arguments to where I would, they would say, you know, Josh, what's going on? And I would get to the point to where we'd get in a, almost like a conversation and I'd tell them, I was like, you don't even know me. I was like, you don't even know who I am. And there was points in times to where they sat me down and says, Josh, you know, what's up? You're saying that we don't know you and we've raised you for the last 19, 20 years of your life. And it became at that point in time to where I started sharing what my experiences were. And I tried to communicate how appreciative I was for life itself. How grateful I was to have them as parents. To be able to wake up and breathe another day. To be able to have the relationships and the love form with everybody I come in contact with. That was something that I just kind of honed in on over the last few years. Um, there's been certain books, certain experiences I've gone through, certain people I've had, met, certain uh, friends and relationships I've actually grown and developed to kind of piggyback on what I'm going through or what I've been experiencing. But this is where it's key. Because even though I've seen and experienced so much and I see so much beauty, I wanted to share that. I wanted to share what I saw, what I felt with everybody. I used to pray and I used to write in my journals like, God, give me a way to communicate this to the masses. <sighs> Show me a way to do that. I want to have and I want to make a difference in people's lives. And there's been several times, even last week, where he's given me that experience. He's shown me that he answers prayers. Well, that prayer wasn't just for me. That prayer was for everybody that watched it, for everybody that it touched, for the way it communicated through people. I, um, I don't say things that are different. The words that I say and communicate to people are, is nothing new. I'm just, a different I'm just a different messenger or a different vessel to communicate this. Because I felt it was very important. I felt it was vital. I felt it's something that we need to be very understanding of and know within our hearts of how to treat people, of how to share love, of how to be there for one another. And I strongly believe that this world needs more of that. And I wanted to be 
somebody that had the courage to do so. I, uh, it's even crazy to say or even think that I'm, I'm doing this now. I'm sharing this moment with you because I don't want to do this by myself. I want you to join me. I want everybody to join me. I want my community, I want my city, I want this world to join me. I want to infect this world or inject this world with love, with positivity, with embrace, with acceptance, with compassion, with empathy. Everything that we should be thinking about before we make our decisions, before we create our experience before we have that conversation or we approach a situation a different way. And I, that stems from love. I, when I was going through all of this in this transition, I realized coming from a spiritual background, a religious background, that God is love. Love is what he communicates. A lot of, peer, a lot of people can't relate with that. So I just choose love as a whole. That's something we all feel, we've all felt, we've all experienced, and we all know. It's something we can't touch, it's something malleable we can actually see. There's no proof of it, but it's a sensation, a feeling that goes through your body that you know is there and you can't deny it. That's what needs to be shared. There's a lot of power in that word, in that experience, in that emotion that I learned at a very young age. And I wanna harness that. And I wanna communicate that to you. But like I said, I don't wanna do this alone. I'm not in this for myself. I'm in this for us. This is about we. It's about us as a community. What we can do and affect directly on everybody on an individual basis. It can start with one person. I decide to make that commitment to myself and to the world. Then I've started. <laughs> I, I have started, but I don't want to do this journey alone. I want you to, to share your stories with me. I want you to share your experience with me and with others. We all have a beautiful story to tell. We can all learn from one another, but we can all take care of each other at the same time as well. Let's do that. Help me share that word. Help me share love in this world. You know, there's gonna be several things that I'm gonna be doing here, probably within the next few weeks, next few months, either through video or engagement or even interviews. Do it with me. I want this to be an experience for all of us, not just myself. There's so much good that can come out of this. Let's put more positivity and love and beauty into this world so we can take over everything. Because that's what really matters, is us, we, and love. Thank you.